This is Danilo Marcucci explaining how he created the grape Bianco degli Anesti, which translates as the perfect grape, as he'll say here. Uh, it's an old variety that he found out in the hills, and then he crossbred it, I think, with Trebbiano to like get it to where he wanted it to be. Ten years ago, I rented a vineyard above the city of Assisi, and I saw it was small of a farmer, and I saw that that, that vineyard was always uh, safe from each season, with no diseases, nothing. So, first year, second winter, third winter, and then I talked with the owner and said, which kind of variety is it? And he said, I don't know, I found here, this is a plant of uh, 70 years old, so, but this uh, have no problem with the oidium or, or perinostra, that are the diseases of the grape. So I brought the kind of vines uh, uh, in the University of uh, Florence. I have a great relationship with the partnership with the university. Uh, and this uh, microbiologist discovered that it was uh, an hybrid uh, invented at, after the Philosera invasion. That is a cross between a, a wild grape, uh, the wild salvatic vines, and vinifera wines put together. Uh, they, they cultivated a long time, but then they realized in the 60s that the contents of the ethanol was too high, you know. It's the same because the foxy sensation in American bites, you know. The ethanol is a very dangerous alcohol for the, for the eyes, for the uh, optical nerves. And so they lost the production of this uh, hybrid. So with this uh, teacher, I decided to make a new cross of this uh, hybrid variety with more uh, Vitis vinifera, more Trebbiano. And after for here of crossing, what's the mean crossing? You have the flower and you make the pollen in the flower and you obtain a fruit that is the mix. You take the seeds and you put the seeds in the ground and you have a new plant that is the cross. Very difficult process, no? Uh, and you need to have a laboratory, you cannot do uh, in the ground. So, uh, I, I have had the possibility to have uh, in the nursery of the university six plants of this crossed, and I grafted the bud one year there, one year here, eh? and I improved uh, this uh, grape variety, which is resistant to all the diseases of the grape. So, that means that this a kind of uh, vines very wild or great of a uh, vineyard very wild because uh, I don't do nothing I do just pruning and I back in September to pick up the grape that's it nothing and I call this variety because I invented with this uh, teacher a uh, perfect grape because you have to do nothing that you just pruning and waiting for the grape and you will taste the perfect grape wine in the cellar. We produce just 600 bottles. Uh, but for me, it's a great, uh, very important experiment. So, this is the most natural wine because we don't use nothing because it has uh, inside uh, his DNA the own defense. It's capable to defend by itself.